as a bodyguard, your only loyalty is to your protectee, not to your family, not to your country, not to Muhammad. You've been doing Ramadan? Shut your sass, old boy. These melons represent your protectees. Throughout this course, you will protect your personal melon as if it was paying your salary. What? Okay, listen up. My goal is to assassinate that watermelon. Your job is to take the bullet. Go! <gasps> go, go, go! Pow! No! Well, your dive wasn't bad, but I just didn't believe you. No! I mean, you gotta sell it. Remember, your no is what gets you your next job. Now drop and give me 20. No! Better. You ladies are without a doubt the most sorrowful click at the dance. Not one of you fit to guard a Russian rock band. However, your checks have cleared, so you all graduate. Congratulations. Yay! <laughs> and now, in honor of your achievement, here is the theme song from the hit motion picture, The Bodyguard. And I, I, I will always love you. There. Oh, for Pete's sake. The pig is in the poke. You know, I really don't care for that code name. Look out, March! Cat! I know you're excited about starting a new job, but could you just relax for now? Hold it, what's your clearance? We just want to get a snack. Access denied. Bidet! Homer, I don't want you using your new sleeper hold on the children. They'll be fine in half an hour. <laughs> That's not the point. And another thing, I asked you to take out the garbage three days ago, and you still haven't... Hmm, still half an hour till dinner. Oh well. Yeah, uh... Ow! It's a real honor to be guarding your body, sir. Just remember, you represent the office of the mayor. So always comport yourself in a manner befitting. Quick, honk at that broad! Good work, Simpson. I couldn't be happier with the way that went. Hey, Homer, I told you not to come around here no more till you paid your tab, or at least cleaned up that mess you made in the bathroom. That you... Mayor Quimby? <sighs> Homer, why didn't you say you was with the mayor? Shove off, puke holes! Get out of there! These stools are reserved for the mayor and his cronies. <laughs> Here's a couple of Duffin Brows, on the house, of course. Hmm. Semi-imported. <laughs> Keep them coming. <sighs> Your generosity is greatly appreciated, especially during this health inspection season. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. Health inspection. That reminds me. <laughs> Your change, sir. <clears throat> We're working on that roach situation, I swear to God. Yeah, you should see the hospital. And after Moe's, we went to Krusty Burger, and the mayor got some more change. And I ordered a double-double, but they gave me the double-double-double-double. And then Apu gave the mayor lots of change for... Dad, don't you see what's going on? That change was a bribe. Oh, honey, don't be so naive. That's how the world works. Sure, the mayor takes a few bribes, but he also makes the trains run on time. No, he doesn't. Trains are regulated by the Federal Department of Transportation. And recent studies have shown that, uh... Homer! 